Good morning and welcome to Kelso Conservation Area. We are exploring the brand new Kelso Cove water park. We are going to have so much fun today, but in order for me to get myself from land into the water, there are a few steps that I need to go through. And this, we bring in AJ. Hi, AJ. Welcome to Kelso Cove. Thank you so much for having us today. This looks like a lot of fun. You're going to have a blast. Opening weekend, it was yeah. a hit, wasn't it? Oh, it's so great. Yeah. So much fun to be had. Um, great to see families out playing outdoors together, enjoying the outdoors, some sunshine, making memories. And this is lasting all summer long, right? Yeah, yeah. we're going to have the cove open from now until Labor Day weekend for sure. Okay. And then we're working on staffing for into the fall. We'll see what that brings us. Um, but uh, lots, of, uh, lots of days ahead of us. It is open Monday through Friday, plus weekends and holidays, 11 to seven every day. Okay, let's get me outfitted. What do I need first? Right on. So steps in the process, you're gonna book online. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you can link to our registration site from the Conservation Halton website. Mm -hmm. uh, once you arrive, you'll arrive here at the admissions building. Mm -hmm. We're gonna pick up a wristband. Megan's gonna outfit us with those right now. Okay. And easy then once peasy. we're all Thank wristbanded you. up, Wonderful. we will get sized for life jackets. Okay. And then following life jackets, it's swim test and go have fun. Okay. So, um, yeah, adult size down here. We can get you all geared up. I'm excited. I, this, I haven't been in the water yet this year, so this is like my first. Today's a good place to start. Yes. Today is a good expand place. Expand those and then you can. <laughs> a little nervous to be all like you're expanding it. Well, just make it easy for you, you to adjust know. as you need. I get it. There I get you it. Go. I get it. I get it. Okay. And then once you're buckled up, give those uh, bands a pull and you can snug it down as tight as you would like. Okay. So once I have my life jacket on. Now, there's lots of things that people can do at Kelso besides the water park, right? Yes. So with your gate entry, you're here all day for a ton of fun. So we've got a guarded swing beach. You can play on the beach all day long. Um, we've got picnic sites. We've got some great activities you can soak in like disc golf that is free to use. Go play uh, 18 holes of disc golf. Mm -hmm. um, and then there are some pay to play sites. Uh, our boat rental beach, Fun. the cove here, our challenge course and archery range. Um, so depending on what you're looking to do, you, you've got options. It's above amazing. And, above and beyond this side of the tracks, up on the escarpment, we've got over 30 kilometers of trail for oh hiking, biking, birding, sightseeing, you name it. On a good clear day, you can be on our escarpment lookout and you can see the CN Tower in the distance. It's it's a pretty awesome place to spend a weekend day. Or I any would day. say so, any day. Okay, well, happy Canada Day. We are going to be uh, getting onto the dock. We're going to watch a swim test because you need to do one of those as well to make sure that you're capable of uh, hanging out at this obstacle. There's so much more coming up from Kelso on Morning Live. We are already having so much fun here at Kelso Conservation Area. Kelso Cove is the name of the water park. Brand new feature this year, mm. AJ. How did it all come to be? Well, happy Canada Day. What a weekend to be open, Thanks, right? I know, right? We have been looking for new ways to get people out and engaged, active in the outdoors. Mm -hmm. um, last summer, we brought on disc golf. This summer, it's the Kelso Cove. Oh. And so adding something that's exciting for families to come out and play on and experience the great outdoors, that's what our parks are all about. And the water's not cold. Like, you would think it'd be a little chilly. It's no Lake Ontario, though. No, no, we're not We're not great lake temps, yeah. um, but water does flow through Kelso, so it stays fresh, it's cool, Clean. it's refreshing, it's awesome. Okay, now swim test is a big thing and it's yes. not just for kids that right have on. to do the swim test, right? That's correct. So everyone coming to Kelso Cove mm -hmm. will do a swim test mm -hmm. and that's to make sure that um, when you enter the water and you're playing on the features mm -hmm. that should you jump off, fall off or anything in between, you can safely get back to the feature and back up and having fun. Okay, so we've got some special individuals. Who do we have here? So James from our patrol team's leading the way and then Councillor Rory Nissan, Burlington, Go is Rory. Uh, following Go up. Go Rory. It's so nice that you have a councillor here. Like the community involvement at Kelso is so awesome. I love that. Yeah, we're, we're open to everybody and uh, and the, the swim test is part of that mm -hmm. safety engagement. We look to try to keep everybody safe out there, having fun, going home with nothing but good memories. So they have to jump in, touch the buoy, swim down to the other buoy, touch that buoy, and then they have to swim back, or is that it? No, so when you go buoy to buoy, then you're clear to head out to the feature. All right, guys, you guys are clear to head out to the feature. Off you go, let's see some moves. Let's see what you got. Have a blast, guys. I always find like there is a little bit of strength and strategy to these. Yeah, you're going to get wet. Um, so this is this is not uh, American Ninja Warrior completed without falling off. This is uh, get out there, get ready to have fun, get soaked, get cooled off. 
Yeah, get cooled off. I think that's the big thing. And how many people can be on the structure at once? So over 100. 108 is capacity. That's what wow. we fill it up to. Okay. Um, and then we do two-hour time slots. Obviously, if you're tired and you'd like to stop early, you're welcome to. Mm -hmm. um, you can for, rest and go back on. Yeah, for people that have booked online, they'll know exactly when they're able to access. If you do arrive at the park and you're wanting to come and play, we just ask you to come and check in. And if we have capacity, we will get you out there. Amazing. Okay, this is so much fun. I can't wait to get a little bit wet, hopefully not soaked. Um, coming up on Morning Life, but for now, I'm going to send things back inside the studio. Well, we've made our way out to the water park here at Kelso Cove, and I'm losing my balance already, AJ. It, like, literally, you have to use muscles you didn't even know you had. Yeah, welcome welcome <laughs> to the water park. Uh, this is definitely about having fun getting wet. So your experience on the park is going to be a little a mix of, like, a little bit of balance, mm -hmm. a little bit of strength, mm -hmm. um, a little bit of getting wet and having fun. A little bit of strategy. Yeah. Yeah, How am definitely. I going to stay the driest I can <laughs> going through this water park today? Um, talk to me about the people that actually can do the water park. Like, we know... Everybody has to do the swim test, but what about little, little kids? Like, this yeah. is difficult for them. So we're open to almost everybody. You okay. have to be five okay. years of age or older, and you gotta be 48 inches tall or taller. Okay. Eight foot 11, believe mm -hmm. it or not. No, sorry, seven foot 11 is our maximum Is our height. two tall. So if you're playing in the NBA, you might you might get excluded. You gotta skip it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's hilarious. Okay, how many different obstacles do we have here? So we got 26 features, mm -hmm. and the features are sort of the big eye-catching elements. Okay. And then you'll notice in between them are what's called swim steps. Mm -hmm. And those are the ones that are real low profile to the water with handholds on them. And the idea there is that when you do fall in, those swim steps are a nice easy spot to just pull yourself back up on top of the feature and continue on with your day. Okay, so I feel like these like these water parks have come a long way because I remember doing one of these about 10 years ago and they did not have the those little steps and it was nearly impossible to get yourself back on yeah and I think like you've, you've probably seen these up in cottage country like yeah. you know, your big water trampoline so there's definitely those types of features that are like off the end of your dock you mm -hmm. own one or two maybe yeah and yeah there's a ladder or a rope thing you got to pull yourself on with <laughs> it's so hard <laughs> these are definitely designed for like playing in large groups mm -hmm. so lots mm -hmm. of easy spots to get back on you'll find one of those swim steps on every side okay. of all of our features so you know you're only in the water for a couple of kicks or a couple of strokes mm -hmm. and then you pull yourself back on if i want to come here how do i go about doing it yeah so you're going to go to the conservation halton website okay you're going to then follow the links to kelso cove mm -hmm. you'll book your tickets online Mm -hmm. And then once you've got your booking, arrive here at Kelso. Um, you will have a time slot picked of when you want to be on the cove. Yep. So you can come in early in the morning, go down to the beach, have a picnic, play on the ropes course, go disc golfing, and then arrive to the cove for your time slot. Uh, you'll make a booking for two hours. You'll grab your wristband, your life jacket, your safety talk and swim test, and then get out here, get wet, and have fun. How many people can I have in my group? So in, in your group, that's up to you. Okay. We're max capacity of 108 on the features at any time. Mm, I have 100 nine friends uh, that's that's gonna be tough you'll have to have a yeah. couple friends on shore yeah. a couple friends on the future <laughs> Oh my gosh, I just love this so much. And what a beautiful day, a beautiful opening weekend. This lasts all summer, yeah. goes right until September. And you're even thinking about keeping it open during the fall. We would love to. We're working on staffing. Um, mm -hmm. We're all staffed up right through to the end of Labor Day. And then as uh, our lifeguard team go back to school they all in the go fall, back to school. that's where we're looking to find some new friends that want to come play so we can be rocking right through the fall. Uh, amazing. Okay, well, coming up, I am going to move. I'm not just going to stand in one spot. I'm actually going to go through some of the course. We'll see how dry I can keep myself. It's the microphones, right? That's what I have to worry about. As long as you have fun, that's what I'm here for. Dry <laughs> is up to you. All right, there's so much more coming up on Morning Live. Stay with us. Okay, we've moved locations and managed to stay dry. So far, so good, right? So far, so good. Uh, little spots like this, we're on one of the features here at Kelso Cove Water Park. Now, if I was to come here, AJ, with my two kids, they are nine and 12, and I wanted to spend the entire day. Can you plan my day for me? Sure, sure can. Do your kids like fun? They love fun. Okay, so Kelso will work well for them. Okay. So if I was bringing the family out for the day, I would be thinking play all day. Yeah. So I'd be thinking picnic. Yeah. I'd be thinking spending some time down at the swimming beach. It's all lifeguarded. We've got a concession down there. You can grab ice cream and cold drinks, the burger oh, yeah. fries, that kind of stuff. Over 30 kilometers of biking and hiking trails, so okay. you can soak in some of the lookouts. You don't have to hike all 30. You could do a quick 2K loop, mm -hmm. or you could you could hike all day if you wanted. Well, you got to get yourself all hot and sweaty so right. you can you know cool off. 18 holes of disc golf, 
Um, disc golf. I don't yeah. think I've ever Frisbee played golf. disc golf. So it's, imagine golf, you know, you're trying to get the ball in the hole as yeah. few shots as possible. Yeah. Disc golf is you've got a Frisbee and it's a basket you're throwing into instead. Okay, that's uh, pretty cool. And then obviously the Kelso Cove, the water park. Yeah. So I'd arrive early. Yeah. Um, parks essentially open just after sunrise mm -hmm. um, and we're open until sundown, like 8.30 at night. Yep. Um, and you, with your gate entry or your membership, you can be in the park that entire time. That's right, because so, you either pay for a gate entry, yeah. and then is this separate? Do you have to pay for this separate as well on top of the gate entry? Yeah, so okay. some of the things like our, so we've got a few pay to play features, okay. um, and you can mix those into your day. So we've got boat rentals, mm -hmm. kayaks, and stand up paddle boards, canoes, paddle boats, that Fun. kind of stuff. Uh, we've got our challenge course and high ropes, so mm -hmm. a big climbing tower over 50 feet in the air, an aerial ropes course where you climb up and you're traversing around. We've got an archery range. Oh those, my gosh. Those ones are pay to play yeah. along with the Kelso Cove. Okay. But there's tons you can do in the park where you don't have to. That's totally included. Ha hang out on the beach, play in the water, uh, grab something to eat, play disc golf, go yeah. for a hike, go for a bike. I mean, lots to do. It is, the list is endless. Yes. Yeah. It is endless. And I love the fact that you guys have so many lifeguards on staff. Yeah. I feel perfectly safe. Even if I didn't want to do it, but I wanted to let my kids do it, I feel perfectly safe staying on shore and letting them do their thing with the lifeguards watching them. Yeah, exactly. Under nine, we require a chaperone to go out mm -hmm, on the water mm -hmm, with. Mm -hmm. Once they're over nine, they can go out on their own. They we on just, their own. We would just ask <laughs> mom and dad or, or parent guardian, whoever, yeah. to hang in yeah. eye shot of the feature, just in case, you know, if they get a little timid or something well, and we sure. want to come back to shore, yeah. we know that whoever brought them that day is here with them. Yeah, of course. If you've got an older teen, you know, Right. that can be your chaperone. So they have to be Amazing. 16 plus to play that chaperone role. Okay, okay, so very limited rules and a lot of fun. There's so much to do here at Kelso. Thank you so much for having us today. Thanks for coming out and enjoying Canada Day with us. I am now going to try my hand at some of these obstacles. You'll be a pro. Wish me the best of luck. <laughs> you can catch all the information on our website at chch.com. Yeah.